Hey guys, it is Julie here with Tip Ranks. In today's video, we're gonna take a look at a few highlights from Xpeng's Tech Day. So let's get into it. All right guys, welcome back and thank you all so much for being here. Today we are discussing Chinese electric vehicle maker Xpeng. The company had a tech day over the weekend where they shared several highlights from their business. One of these includes a flying car. We're gonna take a quick look at these highlights and how their stock is reacting, but just before we get into all of that, this is your friendly reminder that if you enjoy today's video, make sure you hit that thumbs up button and that you're subscribed to the channel as well. All right, let's dive right into Xpeng. Trading under the ticker XPEV with a market cap of nearly $41 billion, the Xpeng stock is currently priced at $47.73. That is up over 10% so far today. On the tip ranks smart score, they do score an outperform with an 8 out of 10 based on bullish blogger and new sentiment, positive technicals, and a strong buy consensus from analysts. One thing that Xpeng went into detail about this weekend was the latest versions of their Advanced Driver Assistance Systems, or ADAS. The next generation of their ADAS is called Xpilot, and it will be rolling out to select cities in the first half of 2022. Xpilot 3.5 will be designed for city driving. Their last X-Pilot version, the 3.0, handled highway-level NGP, or Navigation Guided Pilot. Now the X-Pilot 3.5 will feature City Navigation Guided Pilot and will only be available to drivers of Xpeng's P5 family sedan, which can be built with LiDAR, millimeter wave radar, and a 3D visual perception network that can recognize, classify, and position multiple targets, all of which is essential for city-level NGP. Beyond that, they're also working on Xpeng's Xpilot 4.0. This is planned to be rolled out in the first half of 2023. They want to be the first to deliver a full scenario assisted smart driving experience. This would be for turning the vehicle on to parking it and everything in between. A spokesperson from Xpeng said that the Xpilot 4.0 would not be built into any existing vehicles. Rather, it would be included in a yet to be released vehicle in the future. Another highlight from Xpeng's Tech Day is their new generation X-Power Supercharger. Xpeng already has over 1,600 free charging stations in its network and 439 branded supercharging stations throughout China. But they now have plans to produce these next generation X-Power Superchargers based on an 800 volt high voltage mass production silicone carbide charging platform. These X-Power chargers will be able to give EVs enough juice to go up to 200 kilometers or 125 miles in just five minutes. And an average of 30 vehicles can be charged on one supercharger at a time. But the biggest headline coming out of Xpeng's tech day has to be the flying car. Xpeng unveiled that it plans on becoming the world's top low altitude manned flying vehicle manufacturer, and not just any flying car, a flying car that can also drive on roads. During the event, Xpeng showed a rendering of what looks like a normal car that then converts to a flying car through a foldable rotor mechanism. Xpeng says the low altitude flying vehicle will be 50% of the weight of the P7 and be about 18 feet in length at first with plans to make it shorter eventually. This new flying car will also feature an advanced environmental perception system that can fully evaluate the surrounding environment and weather conditions to conduct safety assessments before takeoff. This flying car is being produced by Xpeng affiliate HT Aero, and they expect mass production to begin as soon as 2024. The CEO said that Xpeng is aiming for the cost of these flying cars to be below 1 million RMB or 157,000 US dollars. And lastly, we also heard about Xpeng Robotics with their cute little pony-sized robot. Xpeng went into further detail about how it foresees smart robots like this pony becoming an intelligent platform for an integrated smart mobility system that can address far more complex autonomy challenges than vehicles. Xpeng even played a video demonstrating how this robotic pony could be used to deliver items such as snacks and other parcels in an office setting. 
The robot will be trained to perceive a diverse environment and multiple targets with 3D route planning, and it'll be able to recognize users through facial, body, and voice print. It's also experimenting with technologies like dynamic acoustic mapping, bionic hearing, a bionic sense of smell, and even a bionic tactile experience through plantar and fingerprint touch and skin sensing. So plenty of exciting and interesting updates from XPeng. Now let's take a quick look at how analysts are weighing in on the XPEV stock. The stock currently has five analyst ratings, all coming in with unanimous buys. Their average price target of $56.40 would be an upside potential of 18%. The most recent rating did come seven days ago with an upside of 32%. So we'll have to keep a close eye and see if any more analysts update or reiterate price targets in these next coming days following this big tech day. Of course, I always love hearing from you guys as well, so make sure to leave your thoughts in the comments down below. What do you think of these recent highlights from the weekend and which gets you the most excited? Of course, these videos are never a suggestion to buy or sell any specific stock and are just meant for information and entertainment purposes. Please make sure you're always doing your own research and due diligence before making any investment decision. If you made it to the end of today's video, make sure you hit that thumbs up button and that you subscribe to the channel as well. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you have a fantastic day and I will see you back here next time.